Welcome to the Battle Drill Devotional Podcast with Captain Rob Westwood Payne. Today is Thursday, the 27th of April. This week in Battle Drill Devotionals, we focus on what it means as God's family to remain connected to Jesus. How does that change the way we do church? The Bible reading we've been looking at is John chapter 15 and verses 1 to 8. Today we're reading from the New International Version. The Vine and the Branches I am the true vine, and my father is the gardener. He cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit, while every branch that does bear fruit he prunes, so that it will be even more fruitful. You are already clean because of the word I have spoken to you. Remain in me as I also remain in you. No branch can bear fruit by itself. It must remain in the vine. Neither can you bear fruit unless you remain in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. If you remain in me and I in you, you will bear much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. If you do not remain in me, you are like a branch that is thrown away and withers. Such branches are picked up, thrown into the fire and burned. If you remain in me and my words remain in you, ask whatever you wish and it will be done for you. This is to my Father's glory, that you bear much fruit, showing yourselves to be my disciples. Amen. Why should I obey God? Many people, including some Christians, think it is a duty, a sense of obligation. But Jesus says it's because of love. If you're a follower of Jesus, then he is Lord of your life, and you must obey his guidance and leading. You can't carry on doing your own thing. Jesus says you are his friend only if you do what he commands. But that leads many people to think we obey God out of a sense of fear or obligation, the idea that that we'll be punished if we don't. But that's not how friendship works. We obey Jesus because he is our friend. He knows what's best for us. That's why he loved and saved us. And so we obey him as a way of returning his love to him. Many of us listening to and reading this devotional are Salvation Army soldiers. We have promised God to do some things like upholding Christian integrity in every part of our lives, maintaining Christian ideals in all our relationships, and being actively involved in our local Salvation Army Corps. We've also promised to abstain from some things like alcoholic drink, tobacco and non-medicinal drugs. We do so not out of a sense of duty, not because we think we'll win God's approval, but because we love him and we believe those things are best for us. Obeying God makes him smile because it means we're making the right choices and making God smile and making the right choices brings us joy, much more joy than the cheap thrills of other things that look so tempting. So choose joy today. Choose obedience. As you think through these thoughts today, you might want to use this question to help you go a little deeper. Do you see obeying God as unnecessarily restrictive or as something that brings you deep joy? I hope to see you again soon for another Battle Drill. If you would like to subscribe to Captain Rob's Battle Drill devotional, wherever you choose to listen to podcasts, or if you'd like to receive them direct to your inbox, head to www.equippinghispeople.com forward slash devotional and follow the instructions. 